Now, today's top stories and Power of 5 weather from News 5, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Hello, I'm Danita Harris, and here's a look at today's top stories. A Cleveland man indicted in connection with the death of Mayor Frank Jackson's grandson is locked up on a $1 million bond. This morning, Robert Shepard pleaded not guilty to charges of aggravated murder, murder and felonious assault. Prosecutors say Shepard directed Frank Q. Jackson to a housing complex where Jackson was shot and killed by another person. Police are still looking for the shooter. Ohio BCI is investigating an officer involved shooting in Rocky River. It happened overnight on Linden Road. Dispatchers told News 5 police responded to a home where a woman threatened to hurt officers and herself. It's unclear at what point police opened fire. The woman who was shot hasn't been identified and her condition is not known at this time. Now for a look at your weather, here's meteorologist from Misha Shea. We are feeling great out there. It is November after all and we're talking about temps flirting with 70 degrees for many of you. So soak up that sunshine, enjoy the warmth while you can because you know this time of the year the weather takes a turn in a hurry. So it is going to be a great afternoon for outdoor plans, maybe getting out there raking some leaves, going for that jog. Running some errands, perfect for all of it. Stretch of 60s will likely stick around through Veterans Day, 65 for that high by Thursday. Slim shot at rain late Tuesday into Wednesday. More rain though for Veterans Day, for Friday, and then there's that temperature crash for the weekend. A little snow possible. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.